Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So I'm actually really excited to film this video. I'm excited because it's a cotton on haul, which I haven't done before, but I'm more excited because I've actually got a new camera. This is the first video I'm doing on my new camera, so let me know about like if like the lighting looks off or I don't know, anything else. But I'm hoping it will look alright. It looks so different than filming on my phone, so I hope it's a good different. But yeah, let me know what you think. So yeah, today I have got a cotton on haul for you. I have never shopped from here before, so I don't really know what to expect. But I've heard some really good things, so I'm excited to have a look. I ordered this actually quite a while ago, so I can't really remember what I ordered. I think I went for like a nice sort of like summery vibe. So the first one is this little dress. It looks adorable actually. So it's got the little tie thing. Is that the front or the back? So it's got a little tie at the front. Um, I'm not sure if that's meant to be at the back or not. But it's a really cute little design. It's like a little like cami dress. Um, so it's not fitted or anything. But I think it would be really cute for sort of like the spring going into summer season. I got this in a size extra small. Oh, this one's cute. I forgot about this. So it's this gorgeous sage green colour that matches my hoodie. And the texture of the material looks really cool. I got this in a size extra small. It looks like it will fit because it's not a tight one anyway. This one gives me proper European summer vibes, which is like my goal for this summer. Ooh, this one looks cute. <gasps> I love this. So this is a strapless dress and look at the pattern on it. It's so cute. I love this so much. It's so like dainty, but like the material feels so good. Like it's quite, not th not too thick because obviously it's for summer, but it's like, it just feels like good quality. And yeah, the pattern is gorgeous. And I also got this one in a size extra small. I'm really excited for this one. It looks, I'm really excited for this one. It looks really cute. Ooh, next up I have a bikini. Ooh, this looks nice. This is a nice colour. Purple's one of my favourite colours, but I feel like I don't have anything purple. I think I've got one jumper and that's it. So I'm really excited about this. So it's got the nice texture there and then the inside is like this. And then these are the bottoms, so quite similar. I got both of these in a size extra small. Ooh, these look nice. Oh, I love them. So these are some linen trousers. I've actually just bought loads of linen trousers from different shops to try on and find my favorite. Yeah, they kind of look more like the beach trousers rather than like everyday linen trousers because I do feel like they'll be a bit see-through. Although it doesn't look it on camera. Well, I'll try them on and see, but it's got all like the pocket details down the side and at the back. It's like a darker sort of beige I mean it's not dark but like it's a darker beige than like the other ones I've gone for but like look at the material again like I can you can just tell that everything here is made so nicely don't quote me on this but I think most of the stuff is made with um either 100% or nearly 100% um organic cotton oh this one says 76% organic cotton but I think all the others have said 100% so like they're all like really nicely made oh I'm excited for those I they actually don't look like they'll be too long either. I mean, you all know I struggle with trousers because my legs are so short, but they don't look like they'll be too long, so fingers crossed. Again, got these in a size extra small. Ah, oh, this is cute. So this is a little a little green t-shirt, like a little baby tee. So it's like the um, sort of like ditzy design again. And yeah, it's really cute. Like that's the print. Again, got this in an extra small and the quality feels incredible again. Like the sort of like thick so you can tell it's good quality but not too thick that you'll be burning up in summer. Imagine this for like a casual look with some jeans or you could dress it up with like a little skirt and some sandals. Like it's very versatile so I'm excited to try that one on. And then last item now. So another dress. I think this is actually the same as the first one but in a different colour. Yeah it is. It's got the tie on it again. Oh yeah the tie at this one is at the back and I think it's supposed to be at the back on the other one as well. So this is the pattern. Same as the pink one just yeah just in green. Again very cute. Very European summer vibes. This feels like it would be like really nice and cool in the summer like the material of this. Right let's try them on. Okay so dress number one. This one is super cute. I have done the tie at the back. But to be fair, you probably could do either and it would still look cute. It's just a really like casual fitting dress, but I'd dress this up and go to like the beach or somewhere, go, I don't know, barbecues um, in the summer. It's just an all round cute dress. This is the tie detail at the back. It's just really comfy and I don't think you could really go wrong with this for the summer. I love this dress. I mean, as Wynn said, this might be my favourite, but this is only the second one. But 
I think this is so cute. It's sort of like the smock style dress. It's quite short, but like it's not too short. It's fine. Yeah, this is definitely European summer vibes. It fits so nicely and I don't think it would be too warm in the summer or anything because it's quite loose so you're not going to overheat in it. I just think this is the perfect summer dress. You could actually wear this for like any occasion. Yeah, like beach and barbecues again. I don't know, pub gardens. What else do you do in summer? I feel like everything you could wear this for. It's so cute and elegant and yeah, definitely European summer vibes. This is the bikini. I put the bottoms on back to front because I just prefer wearing them like that. The whole bikini is super cute and I love the colour. I feel like purple goes really well with blonde hair. It's a super flattering and comfortable bikini, so yeah, I'm really happy with this. I don't want to say I'm disappointed with this one because I'm not. I knew when I ordered it that I don't normally like strapless things, but I feel like I'd constantly be like pulling this up a bit. I don't know if it doesn't sit properly or whether it's my body shape, I'm not sure. But it's a little bit see-through as well, like, not sure if it's going to show up on camera, but you can see the label through. It's really comfy, and the quality feels incredible. It doesn't feel like it should be see-through, but I, I'm just not in love with it. I feel like there's something off, something missing. But, saying that, I've just looked in the mirror, and I can imagine this on a beach in Europe, like in the south of France or something. And I just think it would look so nice, like, with the sunset in the background, just walking down a white sand beach. Like, actually, yeah, it would be kind of perfect for that. I've kind of convinced myself otherwise now, haven't I? I do think this is gorgeous. I think it's really nice. I just don't think it's my favourite. Okay, first things first, these trousers, I am in love with them. They're so nice. They're like such a nice fit and shape as well. Because like some like baggy trousers, linen trousers, they can not really have much shape to them. But these, I just feel like they're so flattering. They fit perfectly as well, which is unheard of. I think I can actually show, but they're not too long. They're maybe like a tiny bit too long, but that's basically nothing, it's fine. And then, yeah, the pockets. Oh, I just love them so much. I feel like they're so nice. And then I've just put this top on as well to try, it, um, to try this on, and this is really cute. I have actually folded it under a little bit because it was just, it was touching the trousers and I like it better when there's a little gap. So I just folded that under a bit, but you can't tell. I love both of these. I feel like these are such a win. Last one is this dress. It's the same as the pink one, just in green. And yeah, exactly the same feedback. It fits nicely. It's comfortable. It'll be cool for the summer. Perfect for any occasion. Yeah, can't really complain. It's got the adjustable tie at the back, which can sort of like cinch it in a little bit more. Or you could have it like completely loose. Yeah. I think I'd prefer it a bit cinched. But yeah, just a really cute everyday summer dress that you could dress up or dress down depending on the occasion. I can't afford to keep everything that I've ordered from this so now I need to decide what I want to keep and what I want to return. I think the beach trousers are like, the linen beach trousers are my favourite. But they're also the most expensive so... To be fair, like I say most expensive, all the stuff there is actually not expensive at all. I think I read that they were 24 50 but that might have been with a discount, I'm not sure. But yeah, first time trying cotton on, overall, was a big success. I love it. The quality of the items is what stands out the most to me. I just think, like, they're so well made and they just feel so nice on. I kind of regret trying it now because I'm going to be buying a lot more from there. They've got the most perfect summer essentials, so yeah, I'm actually probably going to go look on the website now and see what new things they've got in since I last ordered. I hope you enjoyed this video. Let me know if you've got any suggestions for future videos. I love trying brands that I haven't tried before, and I think you guys like that as well. When um, I hadn't tried Manier de Var before, that was, I think that's one of my fashion videos that I've done the best. My travel videos always do better anyway, but yeah, that was the fashion video, I believe that did the best. If you like to see me try more brands that I haven't tried before then let me know because to be honest this is one of my favourite videos to do as well. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!